Panda, 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 Panda. I got broads in Atlanta, Gigi the Lee in the family, credit cards in the scammers, hitting the licks in the van. Legacy. What's up, guys? Sneaker Girl One here with another video. In this video today, I will be doing a comparison with the iPhone SE and the iPhone 5S. So I know this isn't a sneaker video or a video I usually do, but this is just a tech video. And if you like tech videos, comment below if you want to see more. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into this. Here are some sim similarities that both phones have. The design is the exact same. This one has a screen protector. Look at the back. Let me hold them up. See? Same exact design right here. It's just iPhone and here iPhone SE. Another similarity is the Touch ID. They both are the same and they both work the same. So let's start out by talking about the SE. So I got, I'm not sure what colorway this is or color. I think it's the space gray. So you see the silver right here and then the black like shiny black so the camera on this phone is a lot better it has iOS 10 this one has iOS 10 too but it's downloaded on this one this one's a tad bit heavier and it just is a nice phone it is basically a 6 but with the 5s body it has 2 gigabytes of RAM this has more RAM, and I have to say that the iPhone SE has one of the best battery life of a phone I've ever seen, and is one of the fastest phones. It says that it's the fastest iPhone. I don't know if it's still the fastest. I don't know how 7 is, but... So the camera on this phone can shoot 4K video, great pictures, great autofocus, and it also can shoot 1080p, with 60 frames per second so here you have the iPhone 5s so I don't it's the white one the camera isn't so good on this phone it's only 1080p with 30 frames per second that's the best quality it has and it only has one gigabyte of RAM battery life isn't very good on it Okay, so I'm gonna turn them both on. Okay, I'm pretty sure the SE is gonna turn on a lot faster. My 4S takes like 20 minutes to turn on. See, it's already on. Now let's see how fast. It takes, okay, finally it turned on, so yeah. So now I'm gonna see which Touch ID works faster. I'm pretty sure the SE went faster. Now we're gonna test the camera out. This is the SE. I'm gonna hold this up. Here's the picture I just took. Here's the S, a 4S, I mean 5S, my bad. Actually, it's pretty good. 
The video on this one's way better though, it's 4K. So, that's about it for this comparison. If you enjoyed, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and comment which one you think is better. I'm going with this one, so yeah, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. Peace.